pessoal, como é que é daqui ao Simor e sejam bem-vindos a mais um gameplay de Mafia. Estamos no capítulo 8, Os Selvagens Cidade Alta. Vamos ver o que temos aqui agora. Uh, what the fuck? Hey Beetle, rise and shine! Jesus! Marty, stop fucking yelling, will ya? My head's killing me. <laughs> Sorry, Joey. Stop calling me fucking Joey. What the hell's wrong with you? Vito, come on down! Jesus Christ! Que é aquele apanhar do clima ali? Meu Deus, medo. Vamos lá então. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Bem, abri a porta. Oh, temos aqui uma revista. Oh, snap! Oh, shit! Shh, shh, shh. Ninguém viu? Ninguém viu? Quem quiser, coloque na pausa. Vamos seguir aqui a nossa roupa e vamos seguir caminho. Por aqui, por aqui, Oi. por aqui. Ah, pois é, este é o nosso apartamento. Por isso é que eu tenho que ser as escadas todas, meu Deus. Aqui. Onde é que eles estão? Estão aqui. Who the hell was that? That guy's got a voice like Woody fucking Woodpecker. <laughs> that was Marty. Remember the little kid used to live down the street from me? I had to pick up the truck here, so he gave me a lift. What's going on with the truck? It's gonna make us some nice cash. Hop in. I'll explain on the way. You drive. Okay. Where to? Riverside. All right, Riverside it is. Some night, huh? Yeah. Why? Here you go, buddy. Ain't Thanks. still mad, are you? Nah. Very in a stiff. That's the first thing I wanted to do when I got out. Hey, come on. You had fun at the cat house, right? Yeah, yeah, I did. Thank you for that. But uh, everything between then and now, not so much. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, listen, today's going to be a lot better, I promise. I sure as hell hope so. Como vocês lembram, no último episódio, a gente foi ao hotel. O outro amiguinho tinha um pouco de carro. So what's the deal? Simple. We just gotta go to a couple of places and unload okay, these spots. Then we bring the truck back to Eddie and get our cut of the take. Piece of cake. Wait a minute. I seem to remember getting thrown in a clink for a piece of cake just like this. Don't worry, I've done this before. First stop, Riverside. If you say so. Trust me, you're gonna thank me later. Okay, we'll just sit in your fast. Hello. You looking for something special? Okay. Oh. Muita pouca coisa. Não vale a pena comprar nada. Bye bye now. É. Vamos que caminho. Vamos embora. Ok, 
acho que deu. What now? Now we take care of our customers. These guys here buying bulk from us. Come with me. Okay, climb up and hand me the goods. Okay. Hi, one carton of reds. Hand me a carton of reds, Vito. Caixa vermelha. Yeah, that's the one. Here it is, sir. You're welcome. Come again. Hey, good to see you. I'm all out of smokes. Give me a carton of blues. Blues? Blues é este. One carton of blues, Vito. All right. Hand it over. Nice. No velhote, huh? Here it is, sir. You're welcome. Come again. Well, simple. Algumas horas mais tarde. Meu Deus. E as caixas continuam iguais. Bom. What the fuck? Hey, Sarge, how you doing? Caught in the blues as usual? Parece que a polícia também quer. I think I'll take the whites this time. Get that Vito. Let's go. Caught in the whites. Yeah, that's the one. Nice. Até, até que a polícia fazemos deals. Ok. <risos> está a correr bem. Thanks, Joe. Now get the hell out of here, will you? Ok. Time to go. Get in, Vito. Next stop is Millville. <risos> It's going great today. Okay. We're making some serious dough here. Até que a polícia nos damos bem. Vamos lá então. Vou aqui o carro. O melhor que eu quero da polícia até foi aquilo que eu bati. É a coisa que aparece na graça. Vamos lá. Ui, senhor táxi. Acaba já sem carro. Aqui. Só o que é mais. Ele está pronto para ele. Em seus sonhos. O filho não é nem 18 anos. He does jobs for me, drives me around, makes deliveries, that sort of stuff. Thinks he's a gangster though. Spends too much damn time at the movies. Well, the kid's got you for a role model. He's in for a lot of trouble. Oh yeah, wise guy? He reminds me a lot of you when you was his age. Exactly. And I spent two years dodging bullets in Europe and six years in the can since I met you. That's what I mean by trouble. What's the matter? Somebody shit in your coffee this morning? It's like you forgot about all the good times. Yeah, remind me of a sip, would you? That's what's supposed to be. I'm in a rush. Almost makes up for last night. Almost. Come on, what's better than this? You got fresh air, good company, and you're making a shitload of dough. Not too bad for a guy who just got out of the slam. All right, all right. Listen, the next few hours, or anything like the last few hours, all's forgiven. There's <laughs> the veto I know. All right, we'll be there in a second. If you please, give me a cotton of blues. 
Bingo! Here it is. Mais uns links para ti, é que tu tens de sair. Dois dólares em verdade. Vai, eu vou pegar um box de reds. Reds. Got no reds, Vito! Reds for you. Here it is. Yeah, that's the one. Two dollars, bitch. Thank you. Here it is. Não, uma coisa? Ui, ui. Isto não parece que querem. What you selling, Mac? You buying or just window shopping? Maybe. We're selling smokes. Two bucks a carton, hundred bucks a crate. I'll make you a deal. You fork over ten cartons, and maybe we'll let you and your buddy get out of here in one piece. Hey, look, pal. How about you get back in your cute little car with your little friends there, and I'll pretend I never seen you. Sound good? <laughs> you don't get it, do you, you fat motherfucker? This is our turf, and it's gonna cost you to operate here. Now pay up. You're the one who doesn't get it. You have any idea who you're talking to? One last chance. You walk away now and... Yeah, I'll tell you who I'm talking to. A fat two-bit fucking Dago door-to-door -door salesman hocking stolen cigarettes on my turf. And it's time to close up shop, asshole. Ooh. Okay, boys. I think it's time for a fire sale. Shit. Yo! Oh, fuck. <laughs> what do you say now, Porky? Who do I gotta say? That's what it is. <laughs> Come on, hop in that car and let's, let's go. Alright, let's get one of these fucks and teach him a lesson. Good back in. Yes, he's... Step on it, Vito, he's getting away. I got it floor, Joe. This thing won't go anywhere. Vito, listen, we got a problem. We were moving the smokes, and then these uh, these greases came out of nowhere and set the fucking truck on fire. What? You fucking kidding me? You couldn't handle a bunch of grease balls? What the fuck happened? Look, look, Eddie, Eddie, hey, listen, it's not our fault, okay? They set the fucking truck on fire before we knew what was happening, and everything burned up. All right, we popped one of the guys, but... What do I fucking care? Just bring me my money. I paid two grand for that truck, and I want it back. Lucky for you two retards, I got Derek's guy Steve here with me. And we were just talking about what to do with those punks. We're gonna take care of them now. Steve will meet you at the Crazy Horse. You know it? Okay. Crazy Horse. Yeah, I know where it is. Steve's gonna have a few guys with him. Show them that nobody fucks with us. No shooting, though. So it looks like just another gang fight. I don't want to read about a bloodbath in the papers tomorrow. All right, sure. Don't worry. We'll take care of it. Nice. Hey, lad, watch right, we gotta meet Steve in front of the car. crazy horse. Good news is he's gonna help us out. <coughs> Bad news is Eddie wants his money. <coughs> Whole three grand. Shit! You really think we're gonna get two G's out of these guys? I don't know. We'll see what Steve's got in mind. You know he ain't doing this out of the kindness of his heart. Let's go. Vamos lá, vamos agora ao café. 
much music. Oh, Betty was fucking pissed on the phone. Sure he was. Just like I'm pissed right now. Even if these assholes ain't got a dime, I'm gonna kick two thousand dollars worth of shit out of him. I'm with you. <laughs> What's Steve doing working for Eddie? He works for Derek, and Derek's with Vinci's crew. How the hell should I know? But hey, you're still gonna take jobs from Derek, right? Even though you're working for Eddie? We all gotta do what we gotta do to get by. Okay. What is this, the Indianapolis Speedway? Take it easy, I'm gonna rush. Se pra queixasse da velocidade, pá. Mas, Joe, nem pareces tu, Joe. Joe! Vem aqui. Deixa de coisas. Sabes quando eu pego um carro, é para andar rápido, é para andar de ver aí. Em pursuit of a speeding vehicle. Ten for one. Vê se quer. Hey, Steve. Hey. Hey, guys. <coughs> Artie? What are you doing here? Hey, Joe. I'm going with you on this one. Steve needed help. He said I could come along. Steve, uh, isn't this, yeah. uh... Kids gotta learn sometime. Okay, why are we here, Steve, huh? The guys we're looking for are all headed to the foundry. This is where they usually meet, so we'll start here. Then head over to the foundry to finish the job. And, uh, why'd you volunteer to help us? Those bastards trashed my cousin's car. They robbed him and knocked out three of his teeth. Yeah, those fucking assholes. They make problems all over the city. What you Shut up, the kid. Day? I'm talking here. So like the Bible says, an eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth. And well, we'll just start with this joint. So what's the plan? First, we're gonna trash this place. And how are we gonna do that? <clears throat> with this. <laughs> Go ahead, boys. Hey, come on, guys. <laughs> now you can either help us or stay out of our way. <laughs> Let's go teach these fuckers a lesson. <laughs> what the fuck was that? I'm just lying down. Fucking beautiful! Vito, Marty, I got some Molotov cocktails in the trunk. Go get them and throw them in. <laughs> My pleasure, Steve. Got a mo Molotov. Got my zoom. Shut up. Now we go to the foundry. Get in, boys. We'll meet you two at the main gate. See you there. Okay. Dirige a velha fundação. Bora lá. Hey, how'd you get in here? Follow the fucking yellow brick road. <coughs> Next. <laughs> nice one. You fuckers are dead. Joe, watch out! <sighs> Thanks, kid. Shit, they got guns! Right. Let them have it! Joe. Back me up! 
me up, Vito. Shit, let's go! Don't be so gentle, boys! Oh, Try and get around behind him! Let's go! Hurry up and kill him! Good day! Kiss your ass goodbye! How come you moving? What are you scared, asshole? Gotta leave some for me, asshole. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Ai, não consegui acertar num gajo de 2 metros, mas consegui acertar num gajo de 2 metros. Toma, velho. Fuck you! Deixa eu ver aqui. Go around behind you! Difícil de acertar, Jesus. Ok. Ah, munições de mago. Nice. Toma! Okay. Oh, I'm going to get a little bit of 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 a
disparando. Só que os gangsters acertam. <risos> Listen, this got way out of hand. Eddie's not gonna be too happy. Eddie'll be fine. What are we gonna do? Just let him kill us? These fucking dirtbags won't be bothering nobody no more. What now, Steve? Now I'm gonna go home and see if that castor oil's working. I've been blocked up for weeks. I'll see you later. Joy, Joe and I still got a lot of work to do. We'll catch you later. Nice. Shit, where are we gonna get the two G's for ready? You got any idea how much a car like this goes for? Damn, Vito, you're a genius. These babies ain't cheap, right? I bet Derek would give us at least a grand for that one. All right, I'm gonna drive this baby over to Derek's. I'll meet you back in the problem. Sounds like a plan. I'll see you at the bar. Well, uh... <coughs>
saiu do carro, ok. Já saiu do carro. Pronto, já saiu. E agora? Aqui, olha, 2 mil brands, basicamente. Don't give a fuck. Let's go. So, is the money? Well, that's a fucking relief. Stupid fucking junkies. Now they know their place. Good work, boys. Here's your cut. Thanks, Eddie. So, you need anything else from us today, or is that it? I got something I gotta take care of. No, no, no. That's all for today. I'll call you if I need anything. Nice. Bem, pessoal. Este capítulo está feito, isto agora é só ir para casa, mas eu até vou em modo offline para também não ficar tão grande. Por isso espero que tenham gostado aqui do episódio, se gostaram deixem o vosso like e o vosso favorito pessoal, uh, e peço desculpa pelo atraso no, no episódio a chegar ao canal, tenho estado a resolver alguns problemas familiares, por isso é que tenho atrasado um pouco mais tanto o Sims como este, mas em princípio vai voltar tudo ao normal. Por isso espero que tenham gostado, fiquem bem, vá, peace!